Well, it's been nearly three months since the shooting at Rich Neck Elementary in Newport News. And tonight, the teacher who was hurt is preparing to sue the school system. Abby's Werner is still recovering. Her attorney says school administrators ignored several complaints about the six year old shooter on the day of the shooting. We have team coverage. Dana Smith is taking a closer look at what a newly approved school budget includes for security upgrades. But we start with Ann Sparacco. She spoke to Zwerner's attorney who is busy building a civil case. Months after the shooting at Richnick Elementary School in Newport News, many are still asking what happens next. A six year old boy's actions shocked the community when police say he shot his teacher, Abby Zwerner. Well, Abby has suffered an unthinkable tragedy. Zwerner's attorney, Diane Toscano, took on the case, claiming multiple teachers warned the school's assistant principal that day about the boy having a gun. There were failures and accountability at many levels that led to Abby being shot and almost killed by a six year old student. Toscano is now making bigger moves on her lawsuit against Newport News Public Schools. That includes bringing in more legal experts like personal injury Virginia Beach attorney Jeffrey Bright. My goal has been to make sure that um, we fight for justice for Abby and I'm still bringing on experts and rounding out our team. So that is happening and we are going to have, you know, a, a team ready to fight for Abby and be able to go to trial. It's still early in the case and Newport News Commonwealth's attorney Howard Gwynn still has not filed charges against anyone. Toscano says while she is paying close attention to Gwynn's decisions, she is focusing on the lawsuit for now. Abby was a dedicated, caring first grade teacher. She isn't expendable. We're not going to allow them to just move on as if nothing happened. And that's why we're ready to file the lawsuit. Amanda Sparaka for 13 News Now.